Hello again, Booster Brickers and LEGO fans in general. We are working on our March to April challenge box. First up is the minifigure challenge. And I've started reading the story, so I know that with this challenge pack, I'm supposed to build a Viking. Let's open her up and see what we have inside. Got a bunch of little pieces here. Oops. First thing that rolled out is the guy's little head. He's got glasses. Maybe he looks like he's supposed to be wearing a helmet. I don't know. Could be could be cool for a Viking. The torso we were given is a business suit. That's not very Vikingish. Some blue legs. Possible, possible. Oh. This looks like a Catwoman or a Batman kind of superhero hat mask. I don't know. We'll see if we can use that. We've got a suitcase or briefcase. I guess that goes with the, the suit. Walkie-talkie. Megaphone. Spyglass. An axe, a brush, and a tool, a wrench or a screwdriver on the end there. All right, I'm going to look through my personal minifigure collection, see what pieces I have to supplement this in order to make my best Viking. I'll see you in a minute. Okay, I've collected a few pieces. I don't have a large minifigure collection. So my choices were kind of limited, but here's what I pulled to make a Viking. This torso, it's actually backwards. I took the arms off, switched them around so that I wouldn't have the uh, ammo showing because I don't want that. I just want the strap. So for my Viking, this is what I'm going to do. Got double-sided head here. Hard decision, which side do I want to use? I think I'm going to use this one though. And then I'm going to put a nice big beard. Vikings, I don't think, typically had that much hair. They were usually shaved, but my Viking's hairy. Um, this is a piece I got, I think, with the last minifigure build challenge. So we are going to use this as a shield and Vikings typically have axes so he's got an axe and there we have our Viking Urgh. Now it's time to submit them.